Hi everyone, it's Mary. I am a jazz singer by profession in Japan, also the creator of this channel. Thank you very much for watching my videos. I really appreciate it. Today, I'm gonna share with you some exercises for improving your scat singing skills. This is great exercises for jazz singers, especially for the beginners. Okay, let's get started. First of all, scat singing is one of the vocal improvisation skills. It is the impromptu melody which is created by singers. So we cannot play the exact same performance since it is improvisation. To improve your scat singing skills, it is very important to get used to the chord progressions and the chord sound themselves. And you should make sure to imagine the next chord sound before you sing. If you know about music theory well, that's perfect. But it's okay even if you don't know the chord names. At least you need to train your ears if you want to try vocal improvisation. Actually, I've already posted some videos about scat singing, so please check them out too. So, here's the way to train your ears and scat singing skills. Let's get started. First of all, listen to the song which you want to try scat singing again and again until you can feel I got used to the progressions of the song. If you can memorize it, that will be wonderful. After that, check the music chart. Basically, charts of jazz music have key, tempo, melody, and chord progressions. I'm gonna talk about chord names in other videos later, but please listen to the music one more time with its music chart. Maybe you can find some similar chord progressions in one song. That's the point. Most jazz songs have common chord progressions. It is very important to get used to them. So, let's practice the most common chord progression. First, let's try the chord progressions of 2-5-1. It is one of the most common chord progressions. Please listen to the sound of root notes progressions. Do, da, da. Root note means the very bottom note of each chord. Let's try hitting the root notes and listen as it progress. For example, in key of C major, 2-5-1 means D minor 7, G7, and C major 7. The root notes are D, G, C. As I said, I'm gonna talk about chord names in other videos later, so don't worry if you are not familiar with music theory. Let's sing these root notes. We have 12 keys in music and we're gonna try all of the 12 keys. Please listen to the guide tones carefully and try it again and again until you can feel and get used to it.
Next, let's embellish this root notes progressions just a little bit. For example, Do da ba do do ba do da. Of course, this is just one of the examples, so you can try it with your own motifs. Okay, let's try this jazzy motif in all 12 keys. Please listen to the guide tones carefully and try it again and again until you can feel it and you get used to it. How was it? This is just one of the ideas of improving your vocal improvisation skills. You can try it with your own motives and ideas. Of course, it's better to study music theory that I'm gonna talk about later. But the most important thing is to enjoy jazz singing and get used to it. Please don't be afraid of singing freely. I usually post jazz karaoke videos and this kind of jazz tips videos. If you like my channel, please like this video first, share it to your friends, comment down below, and please please subscribe this channel. Thank you very much for your support, I really appreciate it. See you soon, keep in touch please, bye bye! Arigatou gozaimashita!